Distinguished as that was the creator of the Thank you, Parade Commander, the Mrs. Superintendent of Police, Mr. Bismarck Watchers. The National Police Training School. The parade I assigned that you have is Policewoman Constable Juliana Akua. The same is that this program is live. Live on our television, live on Sunday TV, live on Sunday on television, and live on Sunday on Sunday school. I am the National Police Training School. That is also very bright. We hope that you count your time well for being here. And we encourage you to enjoy this memorable program. Thank you. The parade supported by the policeman, directed by Chief Superintendent Dr. Frank Gussie. As I read through a brief profile of the celebrant for today, Mr. James O'Connor, the Inspector General of Police, was appointed the head of the Ghana Police Service by the President of the as the Inspector General of Police in October 2019. He held the position of Acting Inspector General of Police from the second day of July 2019.
given his previous position of a deputy inspector general of police, which he held from the year 2018. <laughs> As a lawyer, he was the uh, senior legal officer at the police department. This is a pleasure to remind you once again that we are live on a number of media networks. The state broadcast the Ghana television, from this television and this human television. For the general salute, Commander, Deputy Superintendent of Police, Mr. Bismarck Wachiasa, Deputy Commander of the National Counter Terrorism Unit. Honored members, distinguished invited guests, ladies and gentlemen, I continue with the police career of the celebrant, Mr. James Okonboen, Antigonian Inspector General of Police. He has served as a station officer before. At one time, he was a regional traffic police officer. He has also served as secretary to the police council and also acted as a district commander for the Terminal Community One Police District. At the police headquarters, he has held several positions, including being the chief staff officer to the Inspector General of Police in the years 2002, 2003, and 2004. He has headed several of the schedules at the headquarters, and these include being the Director General for Human Resources, the Director General for Welfare, with additional responsibility to the ICT department. He was part of the Director General Legal and Prosecutions. He has also served as the Director General of Research and Planning. Director General Police Intelligence and Professional Standards, Director General Services, and Director General Administration. Not only that, twice he served as Police Regional Commander, and these were in the Bruno Ahafu regions and the Greater Accra region. As part of his police career, Inspector General of Police, Mr. Pongwenu, has served in international missions under the United Nations flag 
as you can see from his brief profile on pages two, three, and four of the brochure. And therefore, in 1994, he worked as a member of the United Nations Operations in Mozambique, and from 2001 to 2002 with the United Nations Transitional Administration in East Timor. He was appointed the Deputy Commissioner of Police of the African Union Mission in Sudan, MS7, from 2004 to 2005. Soon we shall witness the arrival of the incoming Acting Inspector General of Police and the Chief of Defense Staff. Distinguished invited guests, we are live on a number of TV stations. Ghana Television, Home Base TV, and Vision One Television. We are also live on Facebook on the Ghana Police Service Corporate page, where if you follow the Ghana Police Service members, distinguished invited guests. Inspector General of Police, members of the Police Management Board, distinguished invited guests. We shall soon witness the arrival of the Minister for the Interior. This program is live on a number of media networks. We are live on the state broadcaster Ghana Television. We are live on Home Base Television. We are live on Vision One TV, and we are also live on Facebook on the Ghana Police Service Corporate page. And so after the event, you can watch a replay also on the Ghana Police YouTube page. Thank you.
of a very senior police officer, and in this case, the head of the police service, the Inspector General of Police. On rare occasions like this, you see the Honorable Minister coming ahead of the celebrant to pay to the celebrant a farewell. And so we shall soon witness the arrival of the outgoing Inspector General of Police. With the permission of the Minister. With the kind permission of the Honorable Minister. May I ask all to rise to receive the ceremony. Thank you.
We pray in the name of God the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Almighty and gracious Lord, we bless your name for the gift of life and for the gift of today. We thank you for our nation, Ghana. We adore you for the security services of our nation. We gather here this morning in recognition and honor of your servants, Mr. James Okonbueno, who brings his police career to an end today. We thank you for his services and sacrifices throughout his police career. As he exits the service, I entrust him to your care. Protect him and his family. Grant him good health. Bless him for his dedicated services. He saved all officers in uniform in their efforts to maintain peace and order. So, may this good last ceremony be the sources. Praise our Lord God. Jesus, Amen. Praise the Lord. The Honorable Minister of Interior, the Greater Academy Minister. Towards the growth of the service, 
the nation is grateful to you for the noble role played in maintaining the peace of the nation. So, as you retire, high time to rest. Spend more time with your family and pay attention to your health and your spiritual life. As you leave the service, be ready to meet these four groups of people and how you are going to be with them. Relax, 
as I respectfully invite the Honorable Minister for the Interior to decorate him. Thanks. Please please. The Sunny Bands will be decorated with a ribbon bar award for the Inspector General of Police and also the Distinguished Service Medal and Ribbon Bar by the Honorable Minister for the Interior. Come back small, you come back, to change the position small. This is the University of Cape Coast. Continue, continue. On our own, as the same guys, we have a list, a tall list of parcels, but we cannot give them all on the ground. And so we shall have call 27. The police for the inspection. And the rest rose to become commissioners of police. So two of the police of IGP, Mr. James Paul, were here. Honorable 
Henry Corti. Sir, you're welcome. I have a tall list of acknowledgments and I'll find time to do it. At this moment, ladies and gentlemen, Parapo, please shall we have the reading lentil as its place. As we put it in its place, may I invite the outgoing Inspector General of Police to step forward for the Chief of Defense Staff to present his part. That is in your view. It is from the Chief of Defense Staff. And then we have another recognition of his exceptional leadership which was inspired by the spirit of teamwork, cooperation, and mutual support of all community services in building an atmosphere of peace for our country. And so as he retires, we wish him a peaceful retirement and we present him with this. I am sure I have contributed a lot of opportunities. And I feel one. I am also sure that I need some mistakes. Again, I am not dead or disappointed some people about some of the decisions that I took. Especially I'm aware that as I decree, a lot of people who are disappointed and frustrated by transfers and postings to the non urban areas. Because obviously everybody wants to be in the capital and the urban environment. If I hurt anybody by any such decisions, I'm sorry I couldn't meet all your expectations all the time. It wasn't necessary at that time for the good people of this country. Please remain on the square for us. Everything that has a beginning has an end and yields place to the new. The tenure of Office of IGP, Mr. Pongueno, is about to end. Both ensuring that the functions regulations of the service. IGP is responsible for ensuring the day-to-day -day administration of the police service subject to the direction and control of the police council. He is a servant member of the National Security and the Police Councils. The IGP is responsible for briefing the President through the Interior Minister on security and crime situation in the country. Honorable Minister, distinguished guests, at this moment, we shall enjoy some cheering moments from the contingents on parade, and I invite Inspector Al Hassan Abdullahi to hear the cheer, to come and lead the cheer.
was the parade dressed as me. I announced that we shall take the general salute, the final and last salute for the celebrants, the Inspector General of Police in active service. The Honorable Ministers, distinguished invited guests. <laughs> this thing is invited there. Due to the coronavirus protocols, there shall be no reception, but we will make available refreshments after the pulling out. Great commander will report. May I invite IGP Mr. James Okongwenu, the celebrant, outgoing Inspector General of Police, to take the dates.